it's an important phase for you and a lot of guys in that locker room right now. That this is an important year right now, right? You got some things to prove, maybe. Yeah, I think uh, us collectively as a group. Uh, I know a lot of guys weren't here last year, but um, you know we felt like we were a playoff team last year, and um, we certainly came close, but a little bit short ultimately. And um, I think we have a lot to prove in that in that category. Um, we're trying to make sure that everybody understands that the better that we do as a group, um, you know, everybody else feeds off that and becomes um, individually more successful. So we're, we're doing this as a group, and um, that's our mentality. What about you developmental-wise? Say that real fast. Um, and again, a lot of guys in there are in a similar situation, but this is a key stretch for you to kind of show where you belong maybe, huh? Yeah, I think so. Um, you know, for me, I'm just focusing on the process. Um, we're going to, you know, go to work every day, um, you know, try and focus on certain things and um, get my game back to where I need it to be and want it to be and uh, ultimately become a better hockey player from it. Coach announced earlier the leadership group and who's going to be wearing letters this year, and you were a part of that group. Congratulations. I know the Ice Hogs have had alternates throughout the years, home road the last couple seasons, but for you, you're number three. It's the first time we've seen an Ice Hog captain in a little while as well. What did that process mean and for you to be a, a concrete, finite proof of, of that leadership group? Yeah, thank you. It's a, it's a big honor. Um, you know, we have a lot of uh, young guys coming in this room and uh, looking forward to kind of Kind of helping lead that group and um but yeah we we, we announced today about uh, versteeg as the uh, captain and um you know it's it's great for him he deserves it and um he'll do a great job and um you know neil's and sicky as well so we're looking forward to it looking forward to the challenge and um we'll have fun with it too i mean it's uh, it's certainly um a little bit of uh something extra but we're gonna enjoy it and um you know play hard what is it about chris that the young guys are drawn to him I think it's just his energy, you know, it, it, how much he loves the game. Um, obviously, he's, he's been such a successful player in the NHL and, um, you know, obviously his perseverance too. He's had lots of surgeries and come back from that. So I think that's something that everybody can draw from. And, um, you know, he's a great guy and somebody that you can always talk to. So um, everybody should, should like that, um, that he has a C on it. And I'm certainly very happy for him. You've been surrounded by a lot of veterans, too, in your time here with the Ice Hogs, like Lance Bloma, Chris DiDomenico, Cody Franson. But what about Chris has helped you along since you've had some pro experience already, but maybe he has a couple of, of tidbits that can help you push to that next level of your game? Yeah, I think um, it's kind of an interesting time where he came in and he's been through a lot of injuries and um, you know surgeries and comebacks. So that's something that him and I have kind of talked to talked about and uh, something that we can kind of connect on on a more personal level. So it's been uh, been great getting to know him and I look forward to uh, kind of bouncing things off him um, throughout the next couple months. What do you think you learned from training with Crosby over 